I'm here with Todd Lyons, Esquire from 94.5 Cats. I'm Brian Teagarden, News Talk KIT. Of course, it's almost November, no shave November in, uh, in honor is not the right word, but to raise awareness for prostate cancer, which, you know, men can get. And I've known men that have had prostate cancer. So I'm trying to decide whether to go no shave in November or not, or stay clean shaven. So Todd, help me out here. What do you think? Mmm... I think you should do it. Think I should go for it. Just kind of mix it up a little bit. The complete full meal deal. Yeah, uh, if you can, I can't grow a full beard, so I just I always have this. That's as good as it gets. Well, for back me. in the day, mine was red. <laughs> yeah. Now it's white. I think. I've, well, I'm getting a little salt and pepper in there too, so I can really. So you think I had to go for it? Go for it. All right, thanks. Go okay, ahead. now I'm here with Heather. I'm going to ask her about No Shave November. It's for prostate cancer awareness. I'm trying to decide whether to do it or not, and let it just go wild for a month. What do you think? It's for a good cause. May as well. Okay, ladies' perspective. Would you rather have a guy clean shaven or have a beard? My personal opinion, definitely clean shaven. Clean shaven, okay. Mm -hmm. Thing I'm worried about is years and years ago, I had a very nice, luxuriant red beard. Now it's white. It'll show how old I am. It's not quite Christmas time yet. Hmm. So you think I should go for it? It's a good cause. But you, you, prefer, <laughs> you prefer somebody's clean shaven. I do. Hmm. Yeah. Well, we'll put you in the maybe category. Maybe. Okay, okay now I'm with sure. uh, Penny, who is the gatekeeper here at Town Square Media. I'm trying to decide whether or not to do No Shave November. What do you think? Brian, I think No Shave November would do you good. You think so? I think so. You haven't seen how white my beard is. Doesn't matter. November is No Shave November. So, you know, don't shave. All right. Thank you. You're welcome.